is my was my neighbor or unke parents still stay in my in my building unke brother hamare building mein rehte he has shifted to a bigger house to a duplex house a new beautiful house so we all welcome ramesh so ramesh is a successful builder he is a consultant and he matlab unke donations unke philanthropy is amazing list bahut lambi hai and let us welcome this amazing wonderful human being thank you ramesh thank you for coming Thank okay you, rajan and thank you everybody for having me over and uh, i don't know what value i'll be able to add because you all have a great mentor in rajan if, uh, i think whatever you said if you follow you will achieve everything but i still try to share something which i will learn during my career in the course of my life yes ramesh so i would like to you to share something ke dekhi now you are successful i mean everybody appreciates you we come to you for knowledge तो आपका ये कुछ सक्सेस का कोई सीक्रेट कुछ रहेगा तो आप यू वुड यू लाइक टू शेयर टू अस व्हाट इज द सीक्रेट ऑफ योर सक्सेस सो व्हेन आई 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 वाज वाज यंग एंड एंड नो मनी इन द फैमिली दैट रियली रियली बोथर मी सी लाइक ऑन अ संडे द होल बिल्डिंग वुड गो फॉर आउटिंग्स Then I started going abroad. I saw the designer stores, and each like you know maybe a wallet, a belt, but like dominated my my entire being. I I needed it. I didn't want it. I needed it. In fact, let me share you a, a story from the past. Not my story, but Socrates is a great philosopher of his time, and used to give discourses like how Rajan gave, and. Uh, a disciple would come to him and say, "Sir, I want to be very, very successful." Socrates ignored him once, twice, thrice, and then he said, "So why do you ignore me? I want to be successful. I have come to you because you have all the wisdom." With me. So he said, "Okay, let's." So he said, "Okay, walk with me," and he starts walking towards the beach. They reach the beach, they reach the water, and they still continue walking until the water is like almost neck high. Both are there, and then Socrates takes. the neck of the guy and sinks it in the water and and then obviously pulls him out and he said if what did you want to do at that time all i wanted to do was breathe so he said if you want to be successful your desire has to be as strong as that it has to dominate you totally so i'm obsessed with if i want something i'm absolutely obsessed i take a mission i make a goal and remove all other thoughts and i'm only focusing on that And I've seen many, like Rajan said, I've seen many ups and downs. I've been through the worst times. I've uh, had uh, really terrible times. But the only fact that dominated my mind was like, I need to get out of this, and I will get out of this. And I managed to get out of a lot of issues. Real estate has been going through the last, like, the most terrible times in the last seven uh, to eight years. And we've seen a lot of developers being behind bars. We've seen a lot of developers. A few developers committing suicide. Uh, a lot of developers have lost their reputation because they've not been able to pay. They've not been able to complete the building. But uh, in my case, and even uh, I, my team started believing that we won't last. And the only thing I kept saying is, guys, have faith. Like Rajan Pichai, have faith in yourself, and things will turn. And I'll very proudly say. The things have turned for me. I've been able to return all my money to the banks and others. And in fact, I've just done a very big deal. So, so times change, things change, but you have to have belief in yourself, and it has to be your being. I was talking to Rajul the other day, and he said it has to be your being. And for me, being is obsessed with what you want. It just can't be you want it. You have to need it. You have to 
desire it. It has to be part of your every for. And that's where I come from. And that's where I have uh, managed to find success. I've, I've obviously have uh, gone through my own ups and downs. There was a time when I left my dad. This is again another story. And obviously, when family businesses are there, and you tend to uh, part ways and you don't see eye to eye. And so I just left my dad, and it was like almost after 20 or 25 years of effort, I had to start all over again. And only thing which dominated my mind was, hey, I'm very good and I need to prove it. And I want to work with a very large developer so that he appreciates what I do. I, wish. I said, yeah, I was not appreciated in my earlier class, but I would like uh, myself to be appreciated. And it so happened that I became a fund manager. Of, uh, I was called by Mr. Ajay Ramal, and I became a fund manager of a fund called India. I was a developer and I became a fund manager. Fund ma by fund manager, what I mean is you collect money from people, you invest in uh, in uh, other developers' projects, and uh, you uh, obviously try to get returns for a developer or your investor. I, uh, I was totally new to it, but because of that, since I'm, I'm, I'm the best, I'm good, I uh, opportunity was in front of me, I became the fund manager, and I raised 4,000 pros, and I managed 4,000 pros. And I'd invested all over. So what I'm trying to say is everything is possible. Everything can be achieved, but it is your desire which will take you forward. It's not your want, it's your need. You have to you know, keep, keep in mind that uh, uh, that as uh, the need to breathe should be, uh, your need should be similar to like need to breathe. So that's what I believe can make any, everyone achieve their aspirations, be it success, be it money, be it fame, whatever one would desire. Thank you. Thank right, you. Rajan. Thank you. Okay, so kafi logo ko awaz unka clear nahi aarata. So I will just explain Ramesh ne kya kaha. Ramesh ne jo ek hi cheez batai, wo tha hamari language mein burning desire. Unka ye burning desire tha ke mujhe paise kamane hai. उनका एक बर्निंग डिजायर था कि उनको पैसे कमाने हैं सेकंड व्हाट ही सेड वाज उनको फेथ था कि मैं कर सकता हूं नाउ थिंक एंड ग्रो रिच जो हमारी जो फेवरेट बुक है बाय नेपोलियन हिल उसमें जो 13 स्टेप्स हैं उसमें का फर्स्ट स्टेप इज योर डिजायर सपने देखना उन्होंने एक बड़ा सपना देखा था कि भाई बस घर में पैसे नहीं थे घूमने फिरने नहीं जा सकते थे बड़ी फैमिली थी इनके आई थिंक अराउंड 6 ब्रदर्स Five brothers. Five brothers. Five. So, five. Paanj, paanj bhai the, you know, and the, I mean, that is what he said when he was a child, not so much of money to spend because big family, but he had a desire ke kuch na kuch karna hai. So, that was his burning desire, and that became his dominant thought. Kuch na kuch to karna hai. It is my need. And what he said to himself, Deko, unhone kya kaha, wo apne aap se kya kehte hai. I am very good. I am a very big, very large developer. Apne aapko roz bolte te hai. Now this is very important. What are you saying to yourself? I am poor. I am in pain. Main to bimar hoon. Main diabetic hoon. Mera to ye nahi. Mera bachcha nahi sunta. Meri bivi nahi sunti. These are all small. Kyunki sapne bade nahi hai na. Jiske sapne bade honge na. To ye sab chodi chodi baato mein kuch nahi ulja. Uladne ki zero ti nahi padegi. Because now... Your focus is only on your dreams. That's it. I will do whatever is required to accomplish my dream. I will stay focused. I will not get angry. I will not get disturbed. And I have to control my mind. Aapka mind is playing games with you. So we will start controlling our mind. And gratitude helps us to control our mind. Okay. So Ramesh, to thoda kuch aap bataye ki aap you must have had your failures. Aapne kabi life mein so you must have your kind of failures, you know, financial crisis. This. So at that time, how used to think and how did you come out like? So firstly, like you said, uh, it was a belief. You, it was a phase. So when things went bad, it was a phase. It was not a obviously uh, from your experience you learn what mistakes you have made and you don't want to repeat the mistakes because every, like you said in your class, Rajan K, 
every experience is a learning. So if you take out the good from it, it will help you. So obviously I made mistakes and those mistakes became a positive for me because I, uh, it became a learning for me that I would not repeat the same mistakes and use make sure that I don't repeat the mistakes. So uh, coming back to your question, okay, yes, I failed not once, twice, thrice. I failed. I failed quite a number of times. And you fail because uh, you, sometimes you lose sight. You, you get I, uh, you lose sight of things and you take things for granted. This has to happen. But you that's when suddenly you realize uh, and when the nature gives you a jolt, you realize that you wheeled away from the way you think, the way you used to act, the way you used to do. So you pull yourself back. So like I said, I went into this crazy mode of acquisition and crazy mode of borrowing, thinking that there's no end to real estate. Okay. People need simple uh, theory applied, everybody needs a home. But I forgot completely that everybody needs an affordable home. Everybody needs a home that people can buy. But I kept buying land, I bought expensive land, I borrowed, and there came a time when markets crashed. And I was sitting with these lands which were unpaid. Like if, if I bought a land for 50 crores, I'd pay 20 crores, and 30 crores were unpaid. So I did not even have the land, and I had the debt of 20 crores. And so I, I was in a mess. Mess means uh, I, I, I only thing which came to my mind is how do I get out of this mess? I was obsessed with that, and it so happened like Rajan said, the law of attraction. I start my projects, uh, which I had earlier. Suddenly, I saw sales happening there. Suddenly, I saw magic. It was it was like magical for me. Uh, there were properties like which nobody even touched it. I had a bungalow in Pune. Nobody even wanted to go there, and suddenly I get a call. Hey, we want to buy your uh, property. And and that property I'm holding for 10 years and there's not a single guy willing to touch that property. I managed to sell. I was so desperate for money that I had a flat, a large flat in Worthy. And I'd, I'd rented it out because I just needed the money. And then suddenly, and uh, it so happened because renting wouldn't serve any purpose because I had to pay the installments on time. The banks, you know how they are. They take personal guarantees and they go after you. In my life, I've never seen a bigger magic than this. The guy who rented the house, I called him and I said, I need the money. You And I rented it out for two years. Uh, please let me sell it to somebody else. And it so happens that the guy who rented, normally the guy who rents don't buy the house. And he bought the house. And that house was not a small price. It was almost 30 crores. And he bought that house from me. So I feel the, the more I immersed myself in, the more uh, uh, integrity I showed, the more honesty I showed, in paying back people, in paying back, back to the institutions, the more nature supported me. It was like I got help from everywhere. What I had not thought about, that happened. Suddenly, FSI increased, areas increased, and now I'm back in the driving seat. Uh, but I don't want to. Uh, uh, I, I want So what helped me was intent to pay. What helped me was uh, they learn from my mistake. Uh, there was gratitude for every so every time something happened or something positive happened, I would remember God. I would say I would remember my Guruji, and I would say I'm blessed, and because of you, I so I used to count my blessings. Every thing, every time something happened, I kept counting my blessings. So I did this without doing any course or something, but somewhere down the line, it came uh, naturally to me to be grateful. I was always grateful to my uh, parents for who I am, what I am, because. With my dad is where I learned real estate. He was my ultimate guru in business, and I'm always thankful to him for what he has done for us. So coming back, uh, Rajan, went through, so these were the worst times. This COVID times were the worst times, but things changed overnight. Uh, FSI increased, flat values uh, went higher, uh, properties which I had been astray all over they started selling and. Now I'm back in the driving seat and I'm looking at growing my business even further now. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay. So Ramesh ne ye bataya. <clears throat> See now he was how magic starts happening into your life. When you are positive, when you want to do something with faith, when you are pursuing your desires, even circumstances and people, they change. Ab inno ne इतने बुरे हालात में ही वाज अ फंड मैनेजर जिन्होंने 4000 करोड़ रुपया रेस किया 
and now he was a builder also he is in a fix properties kafi le chuke the samajh mein nahi aa raha hai and you understand why magics are attracting acha okay one more thing i just wanted to ask you ramesh ye jo gratitude hai aapne kahin seekha tha kya did you learn or somebody told uh, you to be grateful no no so when uh, no i i will explain naturally to me rajan so you are uh, honest like when i had nothing and suddenly as a, as a child and i started seeing my dad making money i suddenly i tell you we were, we were like i felt humiliated every day of my life people would like literally come and say ke bhai tum log ke paas kuch nahi hai you all are you your you travel your dad travels by bus you travel by bus i saw your dad traveling by bus and it it, it rained right there so when things started changing and by by the time i was in the 10th standard my dad did really well he was one of the first guys who got an imported car uh, and uh, uh, so that's when i suddenly came to i'm thankful to god i said okay for all that is happening because it, it can't happen only through me or because i'm lucky it's somewhere the upper hand is there somewhere i well, asked for the blessing somewhere i asked for uh, i've been uh, grateful to what is happening so it, it came naturally to me rajan but as you grow i i'm i'm also an avid reader so you read and then you realize that what came to me naturally was already there it's, it's part of the universe i got introduced first and learned about it later uh, that's what actually happened to me but like i said you have to count your blessings for everything for the food you eat for the family you have for the friends you have in bad or good that's what i believe and like rajan said don't talk negative about others because the minute you talk a negative about the others your focus changes when your focus changes you losing sight of what you are after so i don't talk negative either i might if, if i have to talk negative i'll talk in front of the person i'll criticize the person who's sitting in front of him say, this is where you are going wrong but i'll never say behind his back because like rajan said negativity doesn't bring anything it only uh brings uh, uh it's, it's not non constructive and you should always be surrounded with more intelligent people like you uh, azim prem ji he said he's always surrounded with more intelligent people. so you you learn more you gain more you experience more and uh, whatever rajan has said is like for me i have experienced obviously i have not done everything what rajan is talking about but whatever i came to me naturally i have done that and it it works like magic and it can work if it has worked for me it can work for every, everyone i was an average student i used to hide in the class and the teachers would not ask me a question i would actually hide and when i was pulled up i was like always stuttering muttering was asked to stand outside the class or asked half the time to kneel down but uh with time as and when my energy is got diverted towards it this is what i need this is what i will add and this is what i want things change for me and it was it is been a magical experience and i want to ups and downs but i have got no bitterness towards life i have got no uh for, why the hell is it happening to me most of the people when it's happening i see why is it happening to me well, and i also believe in the law of karma i said okay, what uh, you must have done in the previous life maybe you have you have to experience the the positive and the negative in this life so that's what it is rajan thank you